Easter eggs, also called Paschal eggs, are decorated eggs that are usually used as gifts on the occasion of Easter. As such, Easter eggs are common during the season of Eastertide Easter season. The oldest tradition is to use dyed and painted chicken eggs, but a modern custom is to substitute chocolate eggs wrapped in colored foil, hand-carved wooden eggs, or plastic eggs filled with confectionery such as chocolate. However, real eggs continue to be used in Central and Eastern European tradition. Although eggs, in general, were a traditional symbol of fertility and rebirth, in Christianity, for the celebration of Eastertide, Easter eggs symbolize the empty tomb of Jesus, from which Jesus resurrected. In addition, one ancient tradition was the staining of Easter eggs with the color red. In memory of the blood of Christ, shed as at that time of his crucifixion. This custom of the Easter egg can be traced to early Christians of Mesopotamia, and from there it spread into Russia and Siberia through the Orthodox churches, and later into Europe through the Catholic and Protestant churches. This Christian use of eggs may have been influenced by practices in pre-dynastic period in Egypt, as well as amid the early cultures of Mesopotamia and Crete. History The practice of decorating eggshells as part of spring rituals is ancient, with decorated, engraved ostrich eggs found in Africa which are 60,000 years old. In the pre-dynastic period of Egypt and the early cultures of Mesopotamia and Crete, eggs were associated with death and rebirth, as well as with kingship, with decorated ostrich eggs, and representations of ostrich eggs in gold and silver, were commonly placed in graves of the ancient Sumerians and Egyptians as early as 5,000 years ago. These cultural relationships may have influenced early Christian and Islamic cultures in those areas, as well as through mercantile, religious, and political links from those areas around the Mediterranean. The Christian custom of Easter eggs, specifically, started among the early Christians of Mesopotamia, who stained eggs with red coloring. In memory of the blood of Christ, shed at his crucifixion. The Christian Church officially adopted the custom, regarding the eggs as a symbol of the resurrection of Jesus, with the Roman ritual, the first edition of which was published in 1610 but which has texts of much older date, containing among the Easter blessings of food, one for eggs, along with those for lamb, bread, and new produce. The blessing is for consumption as a food, rather than decorated. Lord, let the grace of your blessing plus come upon these eggs, that they be healthful food for your faithful who eat them in thanksgiving for the resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you forever and ever. Sociology professor Kenneth Thompson discusses the spread of the Easter egg throughout Christendom, writing that Use of eggs at Easter seems to have come from Persia into the Greek Christian churches of Mesopotamia, thence to Russia and Siberia through the medium of Orthodox Christianity. From the Greek Church the custom was adopted by either the Roman Catholics or the Protestants and then spread through Europe. Both Thompson, as well as British Orientalist Thomas Hyde state that in addition to dyeing the eggs red, the early Christians of Mesopotamia also stained Easter eggs green and yellow. Influential 19th-century folklorist and philologist Jacob Grimm speculates, in the second volume of his Deutsche Mythologie, that the folk custom of Easter eggs among the continental Germanic peoples may have stemmed from springtime festivities of a Germanic goddess known in Old English as Eoster, namesake of modern English Easter, and possibly known in Old High German as Asterisk Ostara, and thus namesake of modern German Ostern. Easter. The heathen Easter had much in common with May Feast and the reception of spring, particularly in matter of bonfires. Then, through long ages there seemed to have lingered among the people Easter games so-called, which the church itself had to tolerate, I allude especially to the custom of Easter eggs, and to the Easter tale which preachers told from the pulpit for the people's amusement, connecting it with Christian reminiscences. Although one of the Christian traditions are to use dyed or painted chicken eggs, a modern custom is to substitute chocolate eggs, or plastic eggs filled with candy such as jelly beans. These eggs can be hidden for children to find on Easter morning, which may be left by the Easter bunny. They may also be put in a basket filled with real or artificial straw to resemble a bird's nest. Decoration and Symbolism Lenten Tradition the Easter egg tradition may also have merged into the celebration of the end of the privations of Lent in the West. 
Historically, it was traditional to use up all of the household's eggs before Lent began. Eggs were originally forbidden during Lent as well as on other traditional fast days in Western Christianity. This tradition still continues among the Eastern Christian churches. Likewise, in Eastern Christianity, meat, eggs, and dairy are all prohibited during the Lenten fast. This established the tradition of Pancake Day being celebrated on Shrove Tuesday. This day, the Tuesday before Ash Wednesday when Lent begins, is also known as Mardi Gras, a French phrase which translates as Fat Tuesday, to mark the last consumption of eggs and dairy before Lent begins. In the Orthodox Church, Great Lent begins on Clean Monday, rather than Wednesday, so the household's dairy products would be used up in the preceding week, called Cheese Fair Week. During Lent, since chickens would not stop producing eggs during this time, a larger-than-usual store might be available at the end of the fast. This surplus, if any, had to be eaten quickly to prevent spoiling. Then, with the coming of Easter, the eating of eggs resumes. Some families cook a special meatloaf with eggs in it to be eaten with the Easter dinner. One would have been forced to hard boil the eggs that the chickens produced so as not to waste food, and for this reason the Spanish dish hornazo, traditionally eaten on and around Easter, contains hard boiled eggs as a primary ingredient. In Hungary, eggs are used sliced in potato casseroles around the Easter period. Symbolism and related customs some Christians symbolically link the cracking open of Easter eggs with the empty tomb of Jesus. In the Orthodox churches, Easter eggs are blessed by the priest at the end of the Paschal Vigil, which is equivalent to Holy Saturday, and distributed to the faithful. The egg is seen by followers of Christianity as a symbol of resurrection, while being dormant it contains a new life sealed within it. Similarly, in the Roman Catholic Church in Poland, the so-called suikonka, i.e. blessing of decorative baskets with a sampling of Easter eggs and other symbolic foods, is one of the most enduring and beloved Polish traditions on Holy Saturday. During Paschaltide, in some traditions the Paschal greeting with the Easter egg is even extended to the deceased. On either the second Monday or Tuesday of Pasha, after a memorial service people bring blessed eggs to the cemetery and bring the joyous Paschal greeting, Christ has risen, to their beloved departed, see Radonitsa. In Greece, women traditionally dye the eggs with onion skins and vinegar on Thursday, also the day of communion. These ceremonial eggs are known as kakina avga. They also bake sereki for the Easter Sunday feast. Red Easter eggs are sometimes served along the center line of Sereki, braided loaf of bread. In Egypt, it's a tradition to decorate boiled eggs during Sham el Nesim holiday, which falls every year after the Eastern Christian Easter. Coloring The dyeing of Easter eggs in different colors is commonplace, with color being achieved through boiling the egg in natural substances such as onion peel, brown color, oak or alder bark or walnut nutshell, black, beet juice, pink, etc., or using artificial colorings. A greater variety of color was often provided by tying on the onion skin with different colored wool and yarn. In the north of England these are called pace eggs or paste eggs, from a dialectal form of Middle English pash. They were usually eaten after an egg jarping, egg tapping competition. In the Orthodox and Eastern Catholic churches, Easter eggs are dyed red to represent the blood of Christ, with further symbolism being found in the hard shell of the egg symbolizing the sealed tomb of Christ, the cracking of which symbolized his resurrection from the dead. Patterning when boiling them with onion skins leaves can be attached prior to dyeing to create leaf patterns. The leaves are attached to the eggs before they are dyed with a transparent cloth to wrap the eggs with like inexpensive muslin or nylon stockings, leaving patterns once the leaves are removed after the dyeing process. These eggs are part of Easter custom in many areas and often accompany other traditional Easter foods. Passover hamanados are prepared with similar methods. Pasanki are Ukrainian Easter eggs, decorated using a wax-resist batik method. The word comes from the verb paiseti, to write, as the designs are not painted on, but written with beeswax. Decorating eggs for Easter using wax-resistant batik is a popular method in some other Eastern European countries. 
Use of Easter eggs in decorations In some Mediterranean countries, especially in Lebanon, chicken eggs are boiled and decorated by dye and or painting and used as decoration around the house. Then, on Easter Day, young kids would duel with them saying, Christ is resurrected, indeed, he is, breaking and eating them. This also happens in Bulgaria, Cyprus, Greece, Macedonia, Romania, Russia, Serbia and Ukraine. In Easter Sunday friends and family hit each other's egg with their own. The one whose egg does not break is believed to be in for good luck in the future. In Germany, eggs decorate trees and bushes as Easter egg trees, and in several areas public wells as Osterbrunnen. There used to be a custom in Ukraine, during Easter celebrations to have krashanki on a table in a bowl with wheatgrass. The number of the krashanki equaled the number of departed family members. Easter egg games Egg hunts An egg hunt is a game in which decorated eggs, which may be hard-boiled chicken eggs, chocolate eggs, or artificial eggs containing candies, are hidden for children to find. The eggs often vary in size, and may be hidden both indoors and outdoors. When the hunt is over, prizes may be given for the largest number of eggs collected, or for the largest or the smallest egg. The Central European Slavic nations, Czechs and Slovaks etc., have a tradition of gathering eggs by gaining them from the females in return of whipping them with a ponytail-shaped whip made out of fresh willow branches and splashing them with water, by the Ruthenians called palavanja, which is supposed to give them health and beauty. Cascaronas, a Latin American tradition now shared by many U.S. states with high Hispanic demographics, are emptied and dried chicken eggs stuffed with confetti and sealed with a piece of tissue paper. The eggs are hidden in a similar tradition to the American Easter egg hunt and when found the children and adults break them over each other's heads. In order to enable children to take part in egg hunts despite visual impairment, eggs have been created that emit various clicks, beeps, noises, or music so that visually impaired children can easily hunt for Easter eggs. Egg rolling Egg rolling is also a traditional Easter egg game played with eggs at Easter. In the United Kingdom, Germany, and other countries children traditionally rolled eggs down hillsides at Easter. This tradition was taken to the New World by European settlers, and continues to this day each Easter with an Easter egg roll on the White House lawn. Different nations have different versions of the game. Egg tapping In the north of England, during Eastertide, a traditional game is played where hard-boiled pace eggs are distributed and each player hits the other player's egg with their own. This is known as egg tapping, egg dumping, or egg jarping. The winner is the holder of the last intact egg. The annual Egg Jarping World Championship is held every year over Easter in Peterley Cricket Club. It is also practiced in Italy, where it is called Scucetta, Bulgaria, Hungary, Croatia, Latvia, Lithuania, Lebanon, Macedonia, Romania, Serbia, Ukraine, Russia, and other countries. In parts of Austria, Bavaria and German-speaking Switzerland it is called Osterreiertichen or Eierpecken. In parts of Europe it is also called Epper, presumably from the German name Opfer, meaning offering, and in Greece it is known as Sugrisma. In South Louisiana, this practice is called pocking eggs and is slightly different. The Louisiana Creoles hold that the winner eats the eggs of the losers in each round. In the Greek Orthodox tradition, red eggs are also cracked together when people exchange Easter greetings. Egg dance Egg dance is a traditional Easter game in which eggs are laid on the ground or floor and the goal is to dance among them without damaging any eggs which originated in Germany. In the UK the dance is called the hop egg. Pace egg plays the pace egg plays are traditional village plays, with a rebirth theme. The drama takes the form of a combat between the hero and villain, in which the hero is killed and brought back to life. The plays take place in England during Easter. Variants chocolate eggs in 1873 J.S. Fry and Sons of England introduced the first chocolate Easter egg in Britain. In Western cultures, the giving of chocolate eggs is now commonplace, with 80 million Easter eggs sold in the UK alone. 
Formerly, the container's Easter eggs were sold in contained large amounts of plastic, although in the United Kingdom this has gradually been replaced with recyclable paper and cardboard. Marzipan eggs in the Indian state of Goa, the Goan Catholic dish marzipan is used to make Easter eggs. In the Philippines, mazapan de pili, Spanish for pili marzipan, is made from pili nuts. Artificial eggs The jeweled Easter eggs made by the Fabergé firm for the two last Russian czars are regarded as masterpieces of decorative arts. Most of these creations themselves contained hidden surprises such as clockwork birds, or miniature ships. In Bulgaria, Poland, Romania, Russia, Ukraine, and other Central European countries' folk traditions, and making artificial eggs out of porcelain for ladies is common. Easter eggs are frequently depicted in sculpture, including a 27-foot sculpture of a pasanka standing in Beggarville, Alberta. Legends Christian traditions While the origin of Easter eggs can be explained in the symbolic terms described above, among followers of Eastern Christianity the legend says that Mary Magdalene was bringing cooked eggs to share with the other women at the tomb of Jesus, and the eggs in her basket miraculously turned bright red when she saw the risen Christ. A different, but not necessarily conflicting legend concerns Mary Magdalene's efforts to spread the gospel. According to this tradition, after the ascension of Jesus, Mary went to the Emperor of Rome and greeted him with Christ has risen, whereupon he pointed to an egg on his table and stated, Christ has no more risen than that egg is red. After making this statement it is said the egg immediately turned blood red. Red Easter eggs, known as Kakina Avga Kakina Aga in Greece and Krashanki in Ukraine, are an Easter tradition and a distinct type of Easter egg prepared by various Orthodox Christian peoples. The red eggs are part of Easter custom in many areas and often accompany other traditional Easter foods. Passover hamanados are prepared with similar methods. Dark red eggs are a tradition in Greece and represent the blood of Christ shed on the cross. The practice dates to the early Christian church in Mesopotamia. In Greece, superstitions of the past included the custom of placing the first dyed red egg at the home's iconostasis place where icons are displayed to ward off evil. The heads and backs of small lambs were also marked with a red dye to protect them. Parallels in other faiths The egg is widely used as a symbol of the start of new life, just as new life emerges from an egg when the chick hatches out. Painted eggs are used at the Iranian spring holidays, the Nowruz that marks the first day of spring or equinox, and the beginning of the year in the Persian calendar. It is celebrated on the day of the astronomical northward equinox, which usually occurs on March 21 or the previous following day depending on where it is observed. The painted eggs symbolize fertility and are displayed on the Nowruz table, called half seen together with various other symbolic objects. There are sometimes one egg for each member of the family. The ancient Zoroastrians painted eggs for Nowruz, their New Year celebration, which falls on the spring equinox. The tradition continues among Persians of Islamic, Zoroastrian, and other faiths today. The Nowruz tradition has existed for at least 2,500 years. The sculptures on the walls of Persepolis show people carrying eggs for Nowruz to the king. The neo-pagan holiday of Ostara occurs at roughly the same time as Easter. While it is often claimed that the use of painted eggs is an ancient, pre-Christian component of the celebration of Ostara there are no historical accounts that the celebration of Ostara included this practice, apart from the old High German lullaby which is believed by most to be a modern fabrication. Rather, the use of painted eggs has been adopted under the assumption that it might be a pre-Christian survival. There are good grounds for the association between hares later termed Easter bunnies and bird eggs through folklore confusion between hares forms where they raise their young and plovers nests in Judaism a hard boiled egg is an element of the Passover Seder representing festival sacrifice the children's game of hunting for the afikaman a half piece of matzah has similarities to the Easter egg hunt tradition by which the child who finds the hidden bread will be awarded a prize in other homes, the children hide the afikoman and a parent must look for it. When the parents give up, the children demand a prize for revealing its location. See also References External links Media related to Easter eggs at Wikimedia Commons